Hey, it's Ayo Critic to TSM Gus, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a product review on menstrual cups, so let's hop right into it. Those who don't think you can get tampons or menstrual cups and things like that in South Korea, you most certainly can, just as a fun fact. So, that Korea actually has their own menstrual cup, I forgot what it's called, I think it's called the tea cup. So, go look for that if you're in Korea or interested in maybe buying one there. So. As for menstrual cups, I know a lot of us might be interested in setting the environment and interested in the idea of, oh, I want to go move on to more environmentally friendly menstrual products. Well, yeah, they're expensive. So, the menstrual, so I'm going to be today reviewing the salt cup and I've had experience with the Diva cup. The Diva cup, I believe, is $39.99 for it. Can't exactly remember because it's been a few years. The price really hasn't changed. So I'll insert a picture right here of it. I purchased size one. There are two sizes. There's the one for the people who are, I guess, over 40 or have been pregnant and people under 30 or have not been pregnant before. And I did not like it at all. It pressed into my urethra and the size was not big enough to hold the amount of blood that I need because I have really heavy clothes the first two days. And then the last two days, they're pretty manageable. Like third day, medium, last day, very light. And sometimes I have some spotting on the fifth day. So no luck with that. So I decided to try the salt cup. And I know a lot of people are thinking, oh my gosh, see, it's too much money to just be trying this out and not liking it. But the reason why I even bought the salt cup was mainly because in Korea, something happened to mine. So before you go out and decide, I'm going to go buy the deep cup or anything like that. Hear what I have to say about the salt cup and why I like it and think that you should purchase this over the Diva cup. The salt cup, I bought the duo pack because I didn't want to deal with the same thing that happened with the deep cup last time. So I heard that it is wider, which it is wider than Diva cup, which might worry some people, but it doesn't press into your urethra since a lot of people I've heard had issues with the pressing into the Diva cup pressing into their urethra because it's too long. and. Especially considering the fact that it comes in nice environmentally friendly packaging on my pads. So definitely, you know, I think this is definitely much better. And especially if you have heavier periods, you would definitely might want to use this. So it comes in these nice little handy dandy, comes with these nice little handy dandy bags to carry them in, especially when you're traveling. And if you have no experience with these kind of things, you, there's the C fold, fold to get it in. This is, don't remember what this is called, kind of fold, which is the one that I use to try to get it in. Makes it small at the top. And there's also the seven fold. In all cases, you need to rotate them 180 degrees to make sure that they are completely in. And I really, really like them. I use them especially when I sleep or when I work because it's great not having messes or even when you exercise. However, I still have pads left. So I'm gonna use these up. I'm not gonna just waste these. Is so you know it is what it is with regards to that. But I highly recommend that you get it, especially because when you're traveling, instead of having to carry around bulky pads, you'll just have room for these two little small things that you could honestly just keep in your purse or even your pocket maybe. Or you oh you also won't have to worry about okay where will I get my menstrual items, especially in if you're going to a less developed country. So, and I honestly really like the fact that I believe, from my understanding, don't quote me on this, salt, for every time you buy period products, they make sure that someone in a developing country also gets menstrual cups because we know that a lot of women all across the world, they miss school and things or work and things like that because of periods because they don't have access to proper items like the menstrual cup, like menstrual cups in order for them to, you know, continue working and I definitely think it is especially if you care about the environment it's definitely great for women leaving out waste and I've also noticed that because this holds a lot more blood than just for the place and pads all day it does seem to make my periods a little bit shorter I'm not saying it makes it shorter it's just the fact that it's holding more blood and more slowing out you know it may seem like it's a little bit shorter but it's definitely less messy to deal with especially if you're sleeping you guys today if you like this video and like to see more videos please hit the like and subscribe button please also hit the notification bell to so get notified every time a new video comes out and 
I, please follow, please hit the description box down below to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. Also, if you're wondering where I bought these, especially the duo pack, I got it from Target. So, I'm not saying this because, you know, I work for Target or anything. It's just that I got it from Target because it's the only place that I could buy it. And I definitely think it's worth it. There are other options too if you want to check them out with the Flex Cup as well, especially if you have a little bit more money to spend. I didn't try the Flex Cup, but they also come with some menstrual discs for people who are interested in menstrual discs. They do even have reusable menstrual discs out here too. So, my critics, just yeah, By the way, I forgot to tell you guys, next time I'm going to be reviewing Shea Moisture African Black Silk Whip Shea Butter for Acne Prone Face and Body Bar because I've had this for a while I've been wanting to use it but I finally used up on my Olay body wash so now I'm going to be using it and see if it's actually good for us to sit skin folk out here and acne from people because I have hormonal acne so when my menstrual cycle starts a calling the acne starts a coming 